robot, I presume. I know who you are. You are a count. I've been reading about you. As you um, should know, I am Dr. Grove. I study witchcraft and the dark magics. What are you here for? I know who you are, but have you found the crucible? The crucible? I've never heard of it. This must be related to the six witches of Canudan. Hmm, how long ago? Uh, that must have been something like 400 years ago. 400 years for you, maybe. 400 days, it seems like for me. I remember every single detail. Way back, way back, when it was me and Matthew Hopkins. <laughs> Are you comfortable? For the love of God, leave this place now! You're all cursed as Satan's children! Maybe you should join your flock below, your worship. No! This is a message to the so-called witch finder. The one who is paid well to commit murder to the sisterhood. Your bell is now ours to destroy. Yes, yes, yes. These witches are so powerful. They can fly on doors, for goodness sake! I know nothing what you say, my lord. Where are the remainder of the six? I know nothing, my lord. I know nothing! Come in! My lord. Thank you, Cyrus. I'll be there in five minutes. Thanks, my lord. General, I found you at last. Another old witch? Right, you scumbag. I would like you to meet my comrade, Count Spock, here to witness your beating. We'll speak again later. Guards, take her away! I hope your journey here to Canudan was a good one. Yes, thank you, my lord. Because we all know that this town is cursed by Satan himself. The devil walks through these streets, my lad! The devil! Cursed by the devil? In what way? The town is scared and will say nothing. There's a deadly force at bay. The six witches of Canute. I know for sure that we must find the remaining five. We caught one yesterday and hung her. How did you know it was one of the six? There was a cart carrying supplies. All four wheels were severed. My... my ward was... On site, actually. His name is Edmund. And he saw it happen. He saw this woman muttering some words under her breath. We presume it was a spell. That's powerful. I followed General Sewell on many a crusade, and never have I heard anything like this. So you hung the old hag and sent her back to hell? I need you to move into Dark Oaks Manor to lead the search for these old hags. Anyone who is caught worshipping the devil must be caught and are sentenced to death. Please say yes, old friend. General, it will be a privilege and your assistance will be heavily needed. My dear friend, yesterday the witches came into the church and destroyed our beloved bell by using sorcery. Sorcery? This evil must be stopped. Is the priest dead? No, my lord. He's recovering at the church. He's gone. Well, Meet my trusty ward, Edmund. Nice to meet you, Edmund. Nice to meet you. Come, Ballard, let's go to the rectory. Matthew Hopkins and Associates to see you, my lord. Come in, come in. 
It's okay, my dear, you may leave us. General Hopkins, take a seat. Oh, bless how you were spared from this ghastly evil. Count Spock, this is the local priest. Out. But it's Bicker, actually. Bicker? Yes, I'm not officially a priest, but I work on God's behalf, you know. At the same, I'm no more official than Mr. Hopkins is a general. That title is self-given. No such title which by the general officially exists. But are you officially a count? Yes, I am a count. I'm from Pesaria. I come here four years ago as a mercenary to assist with the Civil War. Now I'm on loan to Mr. Hopkins and from his yes. associate John Stewart. Home to the uh, vampire and werewolf legends, I believe. You seem to have some knowledge, or not. It's my job to study religion, my lord. Witchcraft as a religion has been in this country for centuries. There's always been six witches in Canoodin. Legend tells us when a witch dies, a stone falls from the church tower. Well, the six was hung yesterday. Did one fall? See for yourself. You've become a very rich man. Many towns pay handsomely for your services. But who's paying you in this town? Baker is a strange chap, isn't he? If he wasn't a messenger from God, I'd have his head. Look! lived in the first house. We go there. Oh, great one. Please, show me the way. Curse you! Curse you! Shut up, old witch, and tell us what you know. I know nothing. String the old bag up for witchcraft. In the pits of hell, old wench. There will always be six, three of cotton and three of silk. <laughs> three of cotton and three of silk? Why, what the hell does that mean? I don't know, but the old bag bullies no more. We are running out of time. Tomorrow's all Hallow's Eve. They are the most powerful then. Except for one of the six. There must be four of them now. Yes, yeah, only four now, but still they're the most powerful witches I've ever come across. We're at the beginning, Van, and we still have nothing. Lord Hawthorne was the owner of this manor. He died in battle. Uh, and what is that you're holding? It's to ward off evil spirits. Ah, oh, Vala, there you are. General, I've been thinking, three of cotton, three of silk. Time is running out. The witching hour is upon us. If I said to you, and for all belief aside, what would you say the first house of every village would be? What would be the first thing that would enter your head? God's house would be my choice. Are you both possessed? What are you saying? What if the vicar's wife was the head witch we are looking for? That would explain why the vicar wasn't killed when the witch is attacked. Free of upper class, free of poor class. Of course, free of cotton, free of silk. I hope you're right, Valor. I'm going to the rectory. I'm coming too. This is rather late. What time do you call this? Where's your wife, my lord? Oh, she, well, she's resting in her room. Lying. You're alone here. But, 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 but. Tell us where she is on this Halloween night. She's visiting her sister. In the woods? With the rest of them? What shall we tell the church of England? What are we going to tell the town? That this vicar is married with a witch? Not just any witch. The Grand Witch! You can't. I didn't know she was at first. 
You must not say anything of my part, for God's sake. It will break the Church of England and God's house. It's not that sorry, though, so much. Yes, yes, she's in the woods. She's in the woods with the others. We will be back! Yes, and you can count on that. Devil's work of play. I'm gonna stop this. No, wait. Open the faces of red. We'll raise again. You know what night this is. The devil's work, and you're gonna hang. You shall be dead but rise every year for one day on Hallow's Eve. Ha ha ha. Take that old witch. It was the vicar's wife. The Count was right. We raided the vicar's house, found him dead. The way we found him, I doubt that it looks like something Satan himself would conjure up. From confessions of the captured old bag, it was vicar's idea for his wife and her cronies to destroy the great bell. We have just cut her head off. We will bury her body at the crossroads. The remaining three are still at large. Cut the head off the dragon and the body will fall, Edwin. I'm leaving now. We have done what we came for. Not conclusive, I know, but I'm leaving you in charge. Godspeed, my lord. Finally. My Christ. Hey, old bag, what have you got? Say, I will talk. This is all I know. There is this book. The Crucible, it is told. Many things it can do. Many things make you rich. Make you this, make you that. Make you whatever you want to be. This is false, old bag. No, it's true. A book, a powerful book of spells. Six of the most powerful witches possess it. They are in a town called Canudan. The six are powerful. They are a force to be reckoned with. Locate the first house of Canudan. That's the rumor. Find the first house. You'll find the crucible. <laughs> first house? First what? God, hang this woman for witchcraft. I told you everything. I told you everything to hell, Matthew Hopkins. Easy pickings. Hey, turn around. Give me all your money. Oh. 
my skin. Look at all my bones. At that wet winter, we have a debt to collect. Nice of you to join me. Man, I must be seeing ghosts. Relax, my old friend. Yes, I have risen from the grave. <laughs> but, but you, you're dead. I still am, my old friend. <laughs> If you go out there, you're dead, a witch's bounty. If you stay in here, you're burning hell. This was Lord Holfond's mask. He was the head wizard of the coven of the six witches. There were seven, Edmund. There were seven of them. I dare say he won't be needing this anymore. Join me, Edmund, and we will have our revenge. Yes, my master. <laughs> Created by the flames of hell, you will be known as the Red Devil, my friend. If you're respecting the devil, I've given him other tasks to perform. I knew you would rise. The witch's curse was true, and I'm dying. They're both dead, Matthew. Are the sisterhood dead? The sisterhood are done. They're finished. We've completed what we've started. At a cost, Alan. At a cost. You'll rise every Hallow's Eve. For eternity. You won't leave this town, will you, Valet? You will stay put. <laughs> Goodbye, old friend. <laughs> I will remember every single. So that was the story, the whole story right from the beginning. So the Crucible is a book. How fascinating. I've actually seen it. I can tell you where you can find it. Oh my God, he's gone.